So this is just another quick video on if you are interested in buying used equipment, be sure to check the specs. A lot of people will put a, a really nice picture like this, but you need to make sure that you check the specs to ensure that you're actually getting a good deal. So this particular computer was listed for about $350. I'm not going to put specifics as to the seller. I'm just going to use the picture so you can see this. And it looks really cool. Nice case. Good airflow has a GTX 970, which is not a very good graphics card today for modern gaming. But it's when we click to the next couple of pictures about specs that the uh, system takes a steep nosedive. So this is a Xeon E3 1271V3, which is not a bad CPU for gaming, but it is old. It came out in 2011 and it is not Windows 11 compatible. So this would be one of the older CPUs and you would not be able to upgrade this very much or play it much beyond 2025, unless we're gonna get a cracked version of Windows 11. So the CPU, it's still okay, but not the greatest. If we continue looking at it though, it only has eight gigs of DDR3 memory, which is gonna hurt your speed significantly. You could add more memory to speed that up, but again, it's not going to in its current form, it's not going to do very well for you. Moving along, we can see that it's a GTX 970 and only has a 250 gig. It doesn't say whether this is a hard drive or an SSD. So there's just a lot of red flags here. The fact that the seller is wanting to sell this for around $350 is a little expensive for something like this. I would want something that would have at least DDR4 memory and probably a better graphics card if I was really trying to get into a gaming computer in this price range, you could definitely build something like this uh, for the same money, if not a little bit cheaper and get much better specs. So not a bad build, but it's just too much for the money. If you like these types of videos and want to learn more about gaming computers and how to get the best deals, please like, share, and subscribe.